we are on. So we're just around the corner from the campsite. We've just put the juicy calls in. Noodles just dropped his phone. It's 18 degrees, so Goose has just put his uh, heated jacket on. And we've also heard the news that Space Boy Roy has, co has come off his bike. And the campsite slipped on the grass and apparently the bike's landed on his leg. And I think he's, from what I've been told, his knees a bit mangled. So I think they're still waiting for an ambulance at the minute. So that's about as much as we know. So I don't know how serious it is. I think we're in this one, are you? Let me get off, Nate. Let me get off, Nate. Fuck, I can't get off. I think my legs broke. <laughs> Fuck. Fuck. Don't do shut up. Oh. I think my legs broke. Hey? I can't hear you. I said be too bad shape of it. Hey? I said be Sink them up. There. And I'll talk about the weekender. Our Vernwe weekend. So it's a little campsite we use in Mid Wales, not far from Bala. The weekend is £30 for the Friday and Saturday night, and that includes your Friday evening meal. Saturday breakfast and Saturday evening meal. The cook is Piggy's mom, Wendy. So we've got quite a good selection. Cheese and potato pie and beans. What are you having, Goose? Corn beef pie. Corn beef pie, mushy peas. You can have chicken potatoes, hot dogs, chicken bolti, chicken supreme, spaghetti bolognese, and a whole host of cakes she's baked and made. All for thirty pounds. Say hi, mother. I wonder what you got. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were that shed. Did you? Golf club. <laughs> Thanks, Mum. Thanks, Mum. Thanks, Mum. Thanks, Mum. Thanks, Mum. Thanks, Sounds a bit notchy, that does, Goose. <laughs> Go on, Goose, after this VW. Go. Oh, you know that sounds a bit clung. A bit notchy, that does, Goose. Needs a new gearbox. Right, you're turning right in half a mile. Hi there. Hello, hello. Hi, babe. Oh, God. Hi, yeah. £12.09. And they'll refund you that. Yeah. So I just send them every week what, what I've used. What? You go. Who's that? Who's that? that is. See, Electric showing up 80% in October. Is, that big? is it going to be that good? Oh, hi, guys. Are we all right? 
Are you ready for this? Yeah, yes. yeah, 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 we're real for another yeah, one. Yeah. <laughs> Good to see ya. See you, big brother. Yeah. You can see, we've just taken Roy in the car now. Oh, Sick of waiting for the ambulance now. Sunbeam, how's it going to rate? Ah, uh, not too bad. Oh, it's just missed out then. There's a fine piece of arse sticking up there then. He took a part in the, you know, in the Second World War. Um, I thought I'd just get the 360 going. Dan Ross's new beast on. It's dirty. Yeah, I washed mine before I left it all. I wish I hadn't bothered now. It's absolute minging already. It's now so good. It's lovely to ride. I ain't got any problems about whether I can overtake, overtake now. See, this is the thing. I've always said that. Small CC bikes are more dangerous than big bikes. Yeah. It's a big bike, you can get round in no time. As long as you respect them. Yeah. I've always said the safer, bigger bags, much safer. Strange thing is, as well, that's heavier on paper compared to my old one, but it feels lighter to manoeuvre around, you know, put on centre stand or manoeuvre around, you know, push it around the back yard, etc. the frames and everything, everything just gets lighter and lighter. Mm. Even though you're getting more bike, you're getting more power, but all the parts are getting lighter. It's all designed now, so all the weights low down in the bike. Yeah. You find that now with all these I, new bikes, you just don't feel the weight at all. Because yeah. I, I discovered when I sat on Gooses back at last earlier on in the year, back at K1 Cafe, is sit, s stand with it, both feet flat footed, bike between. I can I can just do that with it. So you clamping, 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 yeah. style. Cool. Yeah. Mm. yeah. He's coming down with the poor people. Well, good morning folks, here we go, Friday the 9th September and it's time for the Motor Ev Firm Wee Weekend. It's been a long time coming but we're finally here, unfortunately so is the wet weather as well. The hammering it down just a bit earlier, stopped at the moment, so hopefully it uh, will stay off. Main thing is if we can just get the tents up before uh, we get any more. So I'm off to meet Mike Davis at the safari park. Me and him are travelling together. The Maverick, Goose and Co are working, so they're setting off later on this afternoon. So me and Mike taking the chance to get up there a bit earlier and as I say hopefully beat the wet weather to get the tents up. I don't care once the tents are up, it's supposed to be dry tomorrow for the ride. So we just have to hope we're lucky. If it is raining when we get there, just uh, wait a bit and try and uh, put them up in a, a dry spot. Good morning. How you doing, mate? You all right? Yeah, it's only me and you today. Just hope we find the place. <laughs> I've been twice, but I was taking no notice. I was just. I have. I'm going to shove it in here. Yeah, Google Maps. Yeah. <laughs> Only trouble is if yours tells you to go one way and mine says another and we go like that. Yeah, all right, mate. I'll get it set up now. Yeah. Yeah, anything because we can't chat to each other, can we? So if we need to stop or to chat, I'll pull up and say whatever we got to say. Um, apparently the postcode of the place doesn't get you to the actual site, it gets you to a bloody house nearby, so 
was some reading here. So if we get there, we're not far away. So, and I might recognise bits then, hopefully. He's put, when you get to the campsite, grab some footage of people arriving, if you see any for the video. Yeah, all right, we'll see what we can do. I'm gonna turn this off now anyway, and put it on later. Bye bye. Yeah, so Goosey's top box and panniers. How much weight have you got in there in sausage and bacon? Fifth. 15 pounds of sausage and bacon. So Vernwy 2022. This, this is our third year. First year we came, we had, I think it was 13 people. 13 on the first one. The second one we had, was it 56 I think? And then this year we've got 80. So we seem to be going up. Yeah, the 80 bikers, because there's a couple of them, uh, they brought the wives with them, so yeah, so 80 people. And I think there's a couple of people joining us just for the ride, meeting us in the morning. Well, that's just nice in that mess jacket now. Goose, I'm showing 19 degrees. What? <laughs> <laughs> Twenty one and you've got your heated jacket on. Yeah, hey, oh, you have. I can see your bright light going dull because it's using all your battery power your bike. I bet you've got it on setting number five as well, haven't you? The hottest. If we are still there, when we get there, and we still went the ambulance, get your camera out straight away. <laughs> get it all on camera. But well, at least we can put the tent up in there. I say when we get there, goose, do a quick hello. But get the tent up as fast as we can, in case, in case it does rain again. We're in, so now the bikes come past, have we? So, that's probably only us going. Be nice with it, it's having, well, probably not these, because I bet this road is just constant traffic. All the time, but I bet it's nice. I bet it's nice living in the countryside. Do you remember that first year, Goose, we had to get to the chippy? It was like 30 miles away. Yeah, I think it was uh, sausage and chips, it cost me 77 quid. Follow me Adam Valley, there's nowhere to cook there, there's no electric, and there was a bit, I wouldn't say she was off with me when I phoned her, she just wasn't very enthusiastic about us going back. Well normally she'd let me book it straight away, and she went, uh, she was like stuttering, she was going, um, uh, uh, no, can you phone back in January and we'll think about it. So I don't, I don't think they want us there. Right, like, remember goes as soon as you go over the bridge, turn right. Oh, you, oh, you pina colada. Your crack sack and ball sack of cracker. Right then, let's go and see what's happened to our, our Royston. Noodle, do you want to just do 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 shout a bit louder mate? I didn't quite hear that. Fucking up. Pierce me your drums. So here we are. Campsite's just down this road. We'll get to see how many's there. Bear has taken a group out for the ride today. Round to uh, Barmouth and along the coast, I believe. But I don't know if they are back yet. Well, I don't know what time I went out. I think a few people got lost this morning, I think that was turning up there. So I saw a couple of posts on Facebook. Do you remember that first year we come here Goose and this was just potholes everywhere. So this is the little drive up to the campsite. And the campsite is just there behind those trees. But Albie ain't coming, Albie's still testing positive for Covid so I don't know if um, Escobar's come on his own or... I've not had any message from him.
And here we go. Back again. Where's Jester? So we're, we're up there, aren't we, so? Yeah. Hello, sunshine! How's it going? You're right, mate. Oh, oh, yeah. Good to see you, buddy, man. Yeah. So where's Royston then? Pardon? Where's Royston? Has he gone or? Yeah, they took him to the hospital in the car because it would have took ages apparently yeah. to get an ambulance here. So. Where did he do it here? I think he did it before I got here. I think he did it sort of going that way, I think. I'm not 100% sure, but typical, innit? Yeah. He's looking forward to the weekend. Right. Spirits, you know how Roy yeah. is, thankfully. Well, let's go park up and then we'll, we'll see. Minute, see you in a minute, buddy. You won't be better off riding on the grass instead of the mud. Uh. You must have been a big six foot hole now in, the, in this long grass. Hello, Piggles. How are we doing, son? So, uh, I'll take it he's gone in the car then. Yeah, he's messaged his two people. Is he looking mangled? It's just swollen. Swollen and bruised. So I don't know how you take that. I don't think he's broke because he can move it. He's moving, but it's easy. But his knees are dodgy as it is, aren't they? I think he's just got a super dead leg. You've got to be. Um, all right then. Yeah. How many slum it? How many slum it tents have we got here? We've got to go up there. He's putting me and Goose by the kitchen. Yeah. Yeah. brother. So we will back go. Matt needs to go down all down there, don't he? Well, I'll turn my card off because you're boring me. Oh, bears here. He come here straight from France. He just turned up today. <laughs> you must have taken the same route as my missus. <laughs> she put in the site now, late burn me. I'm sitting here waiting for her, thinking, where the hell are you? Checked on the 360 app thing. That's it, at least she's at least she's done it and seen it, hasn't she? I'm not saying you smell, but I'm gonna get going. <laughs> How'd you get on today, okay? Belty. 170 miles. What was the weather like for you? We had about two minutes of torrential. Well that's too bad, is it? You can't moan at that. Two minutes torrential and then what, about half an hour later we were born dry again. Uh. Yeah. They can't moan at that. But, um, I've spoken to all the lads who came. They all said they had a great time and whatever enjoyed it. But just make sure we have a, have a similar conversation. Yeah, well done. Alright, just let us know. Yeah. Matt, see you. Yeah. Brilliant. Right then, let's go and get parked up. Hi, old burger. How you doing, How Victor? You? I filmed you arriving, like I promised. Yeah, well, happy if you clean it. Oh, well. Yeah. What time did you get here? About, uh, I met him at half ten and we were here for about, uh, I don't know, ten to twelve, somewhere like that. Oh, oh, yeah. Set the tents up, luckily, in the dry. And then we naffed off down the garage, got some filled up with petrol, came back and uh, we had it pissed down for a bit, but we were in the tent by then and it's been alright. It looks like it's going to be dry now, staying dry. 
Yeah. So it should be sound. I filmed an intro when I left home, just till I got to the safari park for you. Then I turned it off, and I've just put it on again now, just for you arriving, all right? So you can cook what bits out you don't want. Superb. Davos! I'm going to switch off now, all right? Where's my bacon and my sausage? I said you to go and get it, where is it? Yeah. No, you didn't. <laughs> you was going to get it yourself, you blew me out. He's got it in here. You blew me out. <laughs> I am talking to you. <laughs> right, I've got to get up here. Let's see how it goes. Hello. Yeah. <laughs> Where's me Thunderfoot? There we go. Ugh. Right, so here we are, we've got here. Here's everybody. We've got everybody over there. Everybody's just had the food. There's Piggy's mum, she's done all the cooking, all the food in there. So Royston, 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 Royston's on his way back. He's fractured his leg below the knee. So he's come off the bike, but he's, um, he is alive. We've just got a plan now, we've got to get his bike back. We need to get his bike back home for him, because he's not going to be riding. But it's dry. It's still quite warm, actually. Still quite warm. Here's Mrs. Pig. Say hello to YouTube. Hello. Don't, don't think you're going to escape. <laughs> <laughs> I've got this ready for when Oggy has his worst days riding. <laughs> but has he already had it? Keep, keep it charged. <laughs> 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 Right. Yeah. Yeah. His, his wife does the t-shirts, I'm good at that. I've told you earlier about what having a conversation with him is like. Well, so that's why I try not to tell him stuff. Oh, yeah. You, Agent Goose, you're shit, you are. Well, well, that well, fuck well. you, I double oh seven. It's double oh six. <laughs> you rush him. Yeah, where's the bomb? <laughs> so he's fractured the knee then. He's it's fractured below the knee. Well, said he broke his leg. He broke his leg yeah. then. Yeah, yeah, the yeah, he broke it. He's, he's just found. They've x-rayed it and they think it's just fractured. So I've just put it in a brace. And just put it so it's not as bad. No, it's not, not as bad. bad. Good. It so did not look. Snap. I think. It's when they were taking think, his trousers off. I think what I was, trying, I think was trying to say was it was meant to padding around his knee. What he saved was taking it. his trousers off. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. I literally look like he's getting gangbanged. Right, do, do you know what the worst part is? I didn't even know if he had fell over. I was on the intercom. I was on the intercom. I was going, Matt, I said, what's going on there? He went, he's someone down. I said, like, nah, they're unpacking the tent. They were putting his fucking chains off. He's fucking, I've literally saw half of his old man sticking out of him. Yeah, oh, did he say he's fucking 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 He took his trousers off, he said. I had to push his bollock back in. <laughs> yeah, we've already seen it. <laughs> not not <laughs> with his tongue, that's me. As soon as she got below the knee, he was like, ah! There wasn't a fabric, there was a head. Oh, I, saw I, a head. Head. I did. Might have been his bell end, to be honest. <laughs> right, yeah, it was one head. <laughs> well, he got glasses on it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, we just found. He went, um, is there any food left? I'm on my way back. Oh, he's coming back. Yeah, he's on his way. Oh, good lad. Yeah, right. Oh, is he? 
So I imagine, you, I imagine you'll just, yeah, you'll just stop here when you for the weekend. Yeah. Roy, we love you really. Thankfully he's got a DCT. By, by, by the way, Roy, he saw you come off and he did nothing about it, he drove off. He told him to go faster to drive over you. I've got you some off for helping, actually. I helped. I'm just fucking gutted and missed it. Yeah. <laughs> and Goose is missed, he's gutted he missed your bollocks hanging out. Again. <laughs> getting right, thanks, Dil, my man. Oh, what you got, Dil? Let's have a butcher's. Yeah. Well, make all the best yeah. ones. Do you want one? Are you kind? Yeah, yeah. Dylan, do me a favour, mate. Thank you very much. Dylan. Uh, I've got it in my pocket. Put that in someone's tent. Yeah. 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 Go on, yeah. some more then. Go on, give us a tub. <laughs> I'm on a job. Yeah. 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 The purple one, the nutty. It's melted. <laughs> Down the exhaust. <laughs> Let's meet the mostest of the hostess. So this is Wendy. Wendy Mommy is pig. Mommy Pig. <laughs> now me and Wendy have been privately messaging each other for the last three, four weeks. Easy. Yeah. I'm not going to divulge what we've said no. and what pictures we've exchanged. Oh, do it. Do yeah. It. Do it. And you want more money for it? That's all we were. That's all we were saying. Yeah. <laughs> she said it was new bird discount. First time customer. But Mummy Pig has fed all these people. Soaking wet, and they haven't eaten yet, but there is plenty left. And I've got some more. But don't forget, <laughs> yeah, but don't forget, Roy's not back yet. He's on his way, he's yeah, because he just said to me, and then I love that. He, he phoned me, Piggy. Did, Roy phoned, he said, Is there any food left? I said, yeah. I said, Actually, look at you, Roy, you've lost weight. <laughs> when he left, oh. So, hold on a minute, let's turn the camera back round. Mommy Pig, what are you doing in May? Absolutely nothing. It's alright then. Me and you. Right, me, me and you. <laughs> you should have said, when you say Mommy Pig, and it's Onk. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> mommy Pig. <laughs> 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 this is do we, Pig, do we need to make a Mommy Pig logo? We do, don't we? Yeah. Oh, we'll, yeah. Get you own we'll get you an apron made with it on. Oh, see, now that's perfect. Oh, yeah. put it in there. Mommy, mommy Pig I'll apron. Yeah. The tops. Have a slot. Hold on a minute, Vic. <laughs> now, last year, Hello. last year yes. at Vermwe, we've got, we've, got, we've got witnesses. Piggy is a witness. Noodle is a witness. Yeah. So what, have you, what have you done now? Last, no, no, last yes. weekend, at Ver, last year at Vermeer, you was absolutely bladded, wasn't you? Yeah, I was, yeah. And you were slurring your words a bit. Apparently. Like you am <laughs> now a bit. <laughs> Someone told me. Yeah. Before, yeah. Anyhow, yeah. what's up then, Victor? <laughs> Would you mind blowing me bed up for me? <laughs> <laughs> I've never heard you called a bed before. Uh, it's normally a horse. <laughs> yeah, I will. Thank you very much. Tell me when you're ready, and I'll see yeah, you. Then I'll You'll school. get it out. It's twenty pound a square litre of air. That's very good. Yeah. Your air bed holds about fifteen litres. <laughs> yeah, we'll be getting set up. I'll. Um... Well, you're here. You're here. You're in the corner, aren't you? Yeah. I'm in. I'm in the VIP lounge. <laughs> Never. I would never do that to you. Motorway. Yeah. Me on the motorway. Yeah, that's us. Cheers. <laughs> Here he is. Here's the man. Don't worry, I'll beep that bit out of the video. No, thank you, mate. If you're heat eating, that means you're alive. Oh, I'm fucking fine. Royston, what have you been up to, son? What are we going to do with him? It was his fault. It was him. His fault. Him. You've, you've done nearly 2,000 miles around France, and you've done three miles an hour on a bit of grass and done that. They weren't even three mile an hour. Yeah, fractured just below the knee. Well, do you think? think. Do you think? Because it might be an old injury. I'll press it again. Oh, no, it's recording. Say hello, everyone. Hello. Hello. Hello, chica. Hello, chica. Hello, chica. Hello, chica. What? 
I don't know if you can see me, it's pretty dark, but we've got the gazebos up, it started raining. Here we are, this is the outdoor event, we've got everybody. <laughs> Say hello! Hello! hello. hello. I bet you won't be able to see anything on it, it'll just be pitch black. <laughs> So, uh, do you want some illumination? Oh, yeah. go on. That's ah, oh, that's it. Go on, Vic. Shine the light on everyone. Yeah. Yeah. I look pissing them all off already. But... Yeah. Yeah. That's the party tent. That's it. Wicked witch of the west. Carol. Carol. Hi. Room apprentice. The lady who doesn't like room. Oh, great, great, unlikely room face. And yeah, the one who likes everything. Hi. The experiment. Mrs. Doubtfire, dear. Mrs. Doubtfire. Oh, yeah. Oh, It's me on the other end. There's a lad, the lad that fell off his chair. At least it wasn't with mine. One nil. Supposed to say no, not yet. Don't wait. Show me moves. Ooh, get in. Oh, he's got. Whoa. <laughs>